What do you get when you take Final Fantasy IV and add better characters, better graphics, and a better villain? Welcome to Final Fantasy VI with me, Tanados. My next Let's Play in my series. Final Fantasy VI came out in 1994 for the Super Nintendo. It was named Final Fantasy III over here in North America because they skipped Final Fantasy II, III, and V, which means we only got one and then two for Super Nintendo, which I just got done playing, and now three. This game took the best parts about Final Fantasy IV and updated them in almost every way, the graphics, more character development, well, for certain ones. Some characters have almost no development. A much better villain, with more plot wrapped around him. A better dialogue, I believe. I am playing a translated version of the game, so it's not the Woosley version. It's going to be uh, done by Skyrender, who had some stuff on GameFAQs and, and has a translation list and stuff. This is my first time playing his version. So I really do look forward to doing it. There may be some cussing in the text. There may be some different names. In fact, I'm certain there are different names. Terra, for instance, is called Tina in this version. So it may be for a, may make for a better uh, gaming experience. But overall, it'll be fun, I think. It'll be a lot of fun. I look forward to playing this game. Um... I want you guys to know, both subscribers and just regular viewers who are watching my videos, that I would like for you guys to vote on my final party, uh, any challenges you want me to play, like a no magic challenge, no shield challenge, stuff like that, I will do to the best of my ability. It, it'll make it longer for me, I'll have to go back and test videos out before I actually record them, just to make sure I can kill bosses and stuff. I've done a no magic video before, or a natural magic video actually, with Terra and Celeste. But I've never done a low level game or anything. The game can be beat on level 7 I want to say, I believe something like that. But I've never done it. I'm not amazing at this game, but I can, I'm pretty confident I can do almost any challenge. So if you guys have anything you want me to do, let me know. Just send me a message on YouTube or comment on my channel. Or even just comment on the uh, screen itself. And I'll be doing that. If I don't get any requests, uh, I'll pretty much play the game as it is. First thing we can see here is Vix is no longer called Vix. He's called Biggs like he's supposed to be. I don't know why American translators fucked that up. Don't ask me. It's pretty easy to, dis to discern. I'm s assuming Star Wars is pretty big for Ted Weasley and people in America at the time. I don't know why they didn't get the reference. But, he is called Biggs in this version. Thank God. I'm going to be quiet while we do this part here, this little segment. I love this music, so we're going to listen to this. Introduction, if you will.
As you can see, the translator is Skyrender in this version, not Ted Woosley. But just really, really pushed the boundaries of the Super Nintendo right there. That segment is just awesome. I remember my friend doing this game. I never owned the game. My friend did. And we, he brought it home. And we were just in awe <laughs> at that part of the game. Amazing. Alright, let me change some stuff up here. Um, memory. I like my window black. Like my men. No, I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. Or am I? I am. Oh, I'll, I'll mess with that off screen. All right, back row for you. Let's move out. We're here in Narsh, and we're under attack by mummies, I guess. I will not be skipping the first battle here, but I will be skipping the remainder battles. This is a battle system. Our unknown girl here has some stuff, some extra abilities that these guys do not have. Bigs and Wedge. Alright, easy fight. Moving on. The future of Narsh! Narsh. Depends on us with a C. Weird. Alright, moving right along. Uh oh. We've got them trapped now! Let's keep going. We must defend the mines with beasts. Moving right along. Ha ha ha. We're basically unstoppable in this uh, Magitek armor we got on. And they call Phantom Beasts, or they call Espers Phantom Beasts in this version, but I'm going to call them Espers. Just for the sake of simplicity. Yeah, my way, rats. Let's save the game. No. We stand over this, and we can go to save. Save the game. That's it. Open up. Up and at them. No, up and at um. Up and at them. Stand back. Alright, I want to thank you guys for watching. Next time we'll be delving deeper into the mines of Narsh. This has been me, Tanatos, for Final Fantasy 6. I almost said 4. I am out.